And mate. Keta ha keta to. You're not usually on cooking. <laughs> well, what are we doing? Well, I hope I'm not cooking. Stacey was like, can't. <laughs> <laughs> Today we're going to make a tipi. Oh, e fare puroku. Ai. Tipi tench using riwai as a stem. Koe right. kite rane koro e tena huatanga. Kare paku. There's a little bit of old school to the new school. Mm, just <laughs> handing down the knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> So, ananga tapu tapu. Four wide dao, 1.8 metres high. Three thin dao, one metre long. A power drill, 7.5 size drill bit. Staple gun. Calico fabric and rope. The things you're going to need to decorate is a riwai or potato, knife, fabric paint and a drop cloth. We need to cut our riwai up into the shapes that we're going to use. I want you to to mahi mai heri pika, make a cross. Ka fai ma tauranga ne, so we'll learn how to use our knife oh, carefully. Kei te pai tonu? Mm-hmm. Aye. Ka pai kotiro. Tō kaha kotiro. Tino pai. Me hohonu rawa, does it have to be quite deep? At least depth of the knife. Okay. Now the big reveal. Te toinga. Ana. Oh. What I'm going to do now is mahi a mai he tapaturu. Um, like a chevron. On trend. <laughs> On trend, of course. This so reminds me of kura. I reckon. And he taimana. Taimana. So you know, know Fana, we're going to go and start painting. Put enough fabric paint in a tray to cover your design. Cool, right? I've chosen some nice primary colours. However, I'm going to mix them together to make some pastel colours. That's pink. Timata tato e paint that? It's time to paint. Te hi o tai? Kaurangi. Kaurangi. Well, I must have the pink then, ne? <laughs> OK, then. <laughs> <laughs> the thing about I this is not to get the paint on the, the rest of the riwa. Whoa. Shake them off. Piwari kuroa kati no piwari. So while we wait for that to dry, we will get our pou ready for our whare puroku. Kapai. Koe rite ke ngā pou. Oh, so you've got holes in them. Did you get them like that? No, no, I'm pre-drilled them. Oh, we like that because someone might go crazy on a power drill. <laughs> <laughs> but there's a little bit of a key with that stace is you've got to just give it a slight angle because you want these ones to thread through straight down. So we need to stand our pou. There's our top. Basically like that today. So our little thin poles are our secures, so they secure the base. And while you do the base, Stace, I'll do the top. And it's just threading the string through the holes. Yeah, the harpia, do you use glue or anything? Cool, cool. It was a very good idea to do this because I am very, very hot. Very hot? Oh, ne, and so you can get some shade, kiroto, ne? Ah, no, it's actually kind of shady. Oh, uh, that's great. I don't want to get outside now. The two nahi no here. Are we just wrapping it? Yep. But we'll just make sure it's even. So we're just going to use the staple gun now. Now I can. Ano te piwari o tene fare puroku. This is such a cute little tent. Happy he o koro fakaro. Ah, he pai he rawe. He rawe? Thing is, you know, the designer ones cost hundreds of dollars. I think our one. Cost less than fifty dollars. Kei te kite hoki te aua haonga tamariki. I like how it's kid designed as well. Exactly. So all we have to do now, Stace, is roll up the sides and then pin them. Piwari tonu wene. These are cute. They are. They are for kilt. The kilt pins. Kia hana nei. How about we get a little blanket paraiki te? Go Hawaii ki to hana nei. Oh, kai he Hawaii ki. Hey, how are you? <laughs> <laughs> we'll leave the kids there for a good while. <laughs> 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 <laughs>